Feeding our Shih Tzu puppies At one month old, a Shih Tzu puppy can start to be gradually weaned from its mother's milk into solid food. They need nutrients to build their natural defenses and promote good bacteria in their delicate digestive system. If they are still a puppy, they may require 46 meals a day. This is because this breed is susceptible to hypoglycemia. With such a fast metabolism, they cannot hold much of an energy reserve. Puppies have a small stomach and their immature digestive system don't react well to being overloaded. To avoid your puppy suffering from disorders such as diarrhea, it's best to split their daily recommended food portion into small meals throughout the day. Shih Tzu puppies less than 6 months old require more frequent feeding times. At this age, their ability to regulate their blood glucose concentration is not fully developed, so it is crucial to keep their sugar levels stable. Establishing a good feeding schedule is a big part of maintaining your dog's diet. To get the best feeding times, you should be able to space out your sheets meals as evenly as possible throughout the day. A Shih Tzu is considered a puppy until it is 9 to 12 months of age. From here, you can move off a puppy diet into an adult one. Use a free feed method to puppies under 3 months old. This is the method of having fresh food available at all times for a pup to eat as they wish. The reason this is done at this young age is because of toy breed puppies are very prone to hypoglycemia, a rapid drop in blood sugar, and one of the causes of this is going too long without food. Do not just stop off the bowl. Doing this will cause old, stale food to stay in the bottom. Rather, keep a small amount in the dish. As needed, Clean the bowl and add in completely new keyboard. Do you have any dietary suggestions when it comes to this breed? What do you feed your Sichu puppy? Share them with us by commenting down below.